Hey everybody, um, so welcome back to another uh, bar Barbarian Skyrim video. We're level 14. We're leveling up, we're wandering. This playthrough is going to be a little more random, I think. Just like that deer. <laughs> uh, so, still recovering from the flu. Doing my best. You guys hear me rustle in the background. I'm just grabbing more lozenges as I play. It's the only way to do it. Um, yeah, doing my best, I guess. My voice is still destroyed. But what can you do, right? I was sick for like two weeks straight on my last week of holidays and my lost a week of work when I came back. And so this is week three for me. Um, I'm still not 100%. It's it's wild. Like I've never had COVID before this. And man, oh man, I never want it again. <laughs> but yeah, we're playing. We're leveling up. I actually did the Vermina quest. Always looking for strong, capable warriors. Um, but what happened was Windows had switched my audio source. So I had my microphone on, but it was picking up way too much, and uh, it's just not really something I'm comfortable with re releasing. So it was just pretty bad. But all we missed really was the Vermina Nightmares quest. But I'll probably just do that on my on my um Breton Pally, whatever. Oh, oh boy. I don't know, I kind of look like Barbarian a little bit more, but the the soft cap I put for myself is like, you know, I can't use uh, healing spells, which I'm so used to, and relying on food and potions. I'd stay away if I were you. I'm on my way to a giant camp, and I can't guarantee those beasts won't think you're part of the offering. What? Keep your distance, and you shouldn't have anything to worry about. What is he talking about? I have everything under control. Thanks for offering. The cow, of course. Others do it differently. But I found that an annual offering usually keeps the giants away from our livestock. Some think it's superstition, but I believe it works. I've yet to have a giant kill any of my livestock. It's tradition. We mark the animal as a way to let the giants know we're giving it to them willingly. Sort of a peace offering. Thanks. You take care of yourself now. I have never talked to this farmer or seen this painted cow. If that is a cow. Oh yeah. Either way this ends up, I'm headed to the inn. I have never interacted with him before, so I had no clue about that. No. I've been playing this game since 2011. Not like all the time, but first time I've seen that. Oh. I guess that's all she wrote. Should I go to this cave? I know it's maybe a Falmer thing. But oh, um, I said in my other Skyrim video. After this video, I'm done recording. I'm gonna switch all my mod list over to MO2 and clean up my files because I got an old animation in my system. So when I'm running. I've actually uninstalled all my animation mods and it's still there. So there must be an old lingering file. So it's like, you know what? I've been meaning to do it for a while. I've been putting it off for months. May as well. I think MO2 is good for anything like pre-2015. Like Skyrim, Oblivion, New Vegas. It's really good. Um, huge learning curve. But I think like Fallout 4, it's fine. Like you don't need it. Vortex of Fallout 4 feel is fine for me. You know. Yeah, it's just that big learning curve getting into MO2. You know. Um, but if you can get it working right, it's okay. But I wouldn't use it. Um, Vortex for like huge mod lists. Like, like Vortex is good for a small little um set of mods. Like for Fault 3, that's what I use. New Vegas though, um... MO2 was part of this guide that I followed and... Got it working good, so that's uh, good news, I guess. So I'm gonna do my best, gonna try. And I totally wasn't paying attention there, we were fighting a Saber Cat. I think I've con- oh, I got a disease. Whoa, look at Lydia just sweeping the place up. 
Look at you go. Actually, I'm going to give this cat its pelt back because I am very much overweight. Over encumbered, maximum mass. If you play uh, Starfield. Or as I like to call it, Snorfield. You know what? It's not even a bad game. It's just really boring. <laughs> That's pretty much it. It's fu it's not fun to play. Like, it's... I don't know. Like, it's, it's all right, right? But not bad. It's just not a lot of fun to play for me. Um, I will take every soul gem I can find. Bowler's writ. What's this? To he who finds this, know that I, Asilius Balar. Oh, it's a blades thing. Do they even have a blades temple here? The attack on Cloud Ruler. What? Did the Thalmer wipe out the blades? Man, I like I like Cloud Ruler. Oh, it's a one hander. I'll take it. Um, and then maybe I'll... Oh, this thing sucks. Is this a two-header? No, it's not. Iron War Axe of Chills. Lagatha Sword. Dwarven Sword of Thunderbolts, which looks cool. You know what? Goodbye, War Axe. Let's use this and this. Wow, that's a cool-looking sword, too, though. Oh, and I have a disease, don't I? Let's pray to the metal cross, I guess. No. Oh, look at it. It's um, Meridia's beacon. Hmm. A new hand touches the beacon. Lord Talos. Listen, hear me and obey. A foul darkness has seeped into my temple. A darkness that you will avoid. Oops. Sorry. Return my beacon to Mount Kilcreath. And I will make you the instrument of my cleansing light. Break of Dawn. I'm going to do that on my, um, my pally character for sure. Get that cool sword. Oh, what is it like? Oath something? Yeah, I like these weapons, but now I'm really over encumbered again. Okay, um, no more pelts for me. I'm officially on a pelt ban. Oh, they're budget on idea. Well, I inter interrupted dinner time. Hmm. So this must be the entrance. Yep. Well, that was kind of cool. Alright, further west, west and south. Are you finished ogling the grotesque? I suppose I should be grateful you didn't simply attack me. Are you finished ogling the grotesque? I am one of the afflicted. I'd have been dead from this plague a year ago if not for Periite's protection. Returning to High Rock, 
Our shepherd lost his way, and I fear Periite's wrath may consume those who remain with him. Kesh could tell you more. I just want out of Skyrim as quickly as possible. You know, I don't think I've ever done that quest before, and I always talk to that guy. Um... Man, I got, like, so much... side quests. So where is that? It's this way? West? Oh, there it is. I mean, I guess I can sort of head in that direction. Oh. Jeez, getting mobbed by wolves. Wolves are no joke. White run, Wifted and Windhelm. Solitude Rorks said. Let's go. Oh, I see a cave. Wait. What? Huh. How did he die? <laughs> he like walked over. The oh, he walked over the trap. Then he just died. All right. Well. That was interesting. Oh, someone looted a wagon. Good for them, I guess. So the attributes I need to look at when I'm for plants is like restore health. So I am like always getting beat up. Did I? Oh, it's on the other side. Didn't go far enough. Yeah, I would not advise for you guys to get sick like, man, like, I like a loss a month of projects I was working on, stuff I was working on. You know, it's funny how you have so many plans that you're in your life that you're planning to do and all this cool uh, you know, uh, projects and things you want to get done and then you know, you think to yourself, like, oh, I'm too sick to stop. And then when you get sick, like, your whole world comes to a screeching halt. And your whole life comes to a halt. And those plans pretty much go down the drain until you're feeling better. Um. I can take, you. take this and hold on to what? it. What? I'll be back for it later. I'll pay you good. Don't lose it. No time to talk. Snitch or double cross me and I'll kill you. I mean it. Okay. What was that all about? I can't carry that. I'm overweight now. Uh, do I have potion of strength? Potion of... Oh, I do. Nope. Still overweight. You know what? I'm going to hold on to that. It's Did you see someone run past just now? Yes. How did you get this? Uh, oh, never mind. I'm going to track down that thief. Oh, he's a thief. I don't care about him. Screw him. Well, he let me through. Oh, he's going to go chase down that thief. Did you get him? Careful. Must have died up here somewhere. I just I saw him shoot his crossbow. Where's that guy? Oh. <laughs> what a noob. Okay, I'm gonna go see if I can go in this cave. They won't let me in, I'll slaughter them. Oh, 
All right, so what is all this stuff then? Chronicles of Chew Left? I don't know. Blah, 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 Dwemers, blah, blah, blah. All right, so let's see what kind of trouble I can get into with mages. Oh, hello, trap. Apparently a lot of trouble. Oh, we got a dead mage here. Necromancers. Oh. My insides. Nice trap. Oh, Lydia. Good job. That is a you problem. Hey, you did it. You stepped on it. Don't step on the trap, Lydia. Don't step. Good job. Smart one. Not really. I ain't that strong. But I have Lydia. Don't see any trick or traps. Gonna be difficult, are you? You know, that extra health might actually help. There's absolutely nothing there. Encumbered. Uh, so it's that and that. She's gonna start a fire, lady. I did not mean to do that.
Oh my. Yeah, level up. <laughs> oh, shoot. I didn't mean to do that. Whoops. Well, too late now. So one handed. Well, I mean, I've got ten points more magicka now, I guess. Uh Whatever that'll do. Restore health. Skill up a little bit every day. There. Ooh, garnet. And get a little bit better at my craft every day. Uh, amethyst. Scourge of the Grey Quarter. Let me guess, they don't like Dark Elves. Yeah, it's gotta be... yeah. Oh, okay, All right. I mean, Lydia stepped on every single trap anyway, so... Nice cozy fire. I think we should go this way. I think that, um, that was that hunter camp. Uh-oh. Screw it. Let's do it. And that looks like a Force Worm. Isn't that like the symbol for the Force Worm camps? Um, but I'm like way too far away from there. I think.
Let's find out. No, I think it's just like a campsite thing. Come on up. Oh, trying to be sneaky. Sneaky bandits. <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> Beheaded. You'll never get ahead in life. Okay. So, resist fire, fortify, nope. Yes, victory is mine. You are right. Uh, that's that it? What is this? Oh, it's iron. Nah, I don't really need iron. I'd have to put some stuff away. Nice and short and sweet, I would say. Well. Kind of go see what this, um, Nordic Rune is. I actually don't know where I am right now. Oh. We're kind of by, um... The Forestborn area. Sort of. I was gonna say Dwemer, I'm like, wait, no. That's the wrong word. <laughs> Forestborn are not the Dwemer. Twilight Sepulchre. What's this? It is something that I cannot do. Okay, then. Oh, wait, isn't this, um... Isn't this thing, like, the end of the Thieves' Guild? Questline? Yeah. What's this all about? What was that about gutting me like a fish? Oh, that's all she had. Worst thief ever. Stalking people in the middle of nowhere. Wait till the Thieves Guild hears about this. Some kind of fort. Cracked tusk, okay. 
Can I sneak in the back way? When's a good time to get lost? Wait, are these all orcs? What the heck? Yep. Maybe there'll be like an orc warlord in here or something. Oh, cracked tusk teep keep, of course. Of course, the name makes sense now. Ow. You know, if that guy had hit me, I think he would have, like, almost killed me. Cause he's just one of those warlord guys that like hit super hard. Oh, I did not mean to do that. I meant to push her out of the way, but that works too. Um, Skyrim. Okay, there's a vault here apparently. It's probably in here or further down. Oh. Well, that's handy. Ah, uh, hi, Lydia. I don't think there's anything to worry about down here. Looks like just treasure. My favorite word. Also, potions are my favorite word, too. Okay. Ah, let's see what's in this one. Rislav the Righteous. Get some light armor. Lydia has a lot of face replacers, and this one I actually like the most. Except for her hair. You know what? I've been playing modded Skyrim so long, I don't even remember what vanilla anything looks like. Isn't that sad? A friend of mine said I should try vanilla just to see what it feels like. I've got a bad I have a feeling it would be like a completely different game. You know, like night and day different. Just because of how old this game is. Come on. Some of these locks are just playing with me today. Draught of True Shot. Uh, I'll sell it. Wait. Who's coughing? Who is COVID? The Rona. 
Wait, what's this? Shards of Maroon's Razor. I don't know what that is. Must be some sort of side quest. Well, guys, um, I think I'm going to call it for today. That was a lot of fun. Got a lot of stuff done. I'm thinking we'll probably do the Markarth quest line on the next one, the um, Silverblood stuff. But uh, thank you so much for hanging out with me. I really appreciate it. You know, if you have any complaints or concerns, let me know. Um, let me know your thoughts. Let me know if you have any um, improvements. And yeah, I'd love to hear from you guys, and I'll see you later.